Maybe how are you doing, boy? Good to see you. All right, great to see you. Can we start with knowing me, Tony Wilson, knowing you, Steve Cooper? Now, how is that? Let's You're rise right. above that, shall we? Okay, move the set piece, Pete. I've got to see Deb, uh, Debbie about shoes. Should we take this nose off now, or should uh, I do a makeup trial? Hey! Yeah. Why do we want to spend a year of our lives making this film? This is funny. <laughs> Cock. That scene, because it looks so cheap, it actually makes it funnier. You know, originally, originally I was going to play uh, Tristram. Yeah, that's when it was going to be a sitcom. He does a fantastic impersonation of you. Oh, you're so dirty. That, I, mean, I, think, I think he wanted the realism. He wants realism? Yeah. Yeah. I'm a grown man talking to the camera in a womb. OK. <laughs> Knowing me, Gary Wilson, knowing you, Steve Coogan. Do you remember anyone called Heather? Everyone back at the office wants to run the story about the girl. Yeah. She's a lap dancer. But she's saying some stuff about the... I don't... Anyway, Steve. Jesus Christ! Rob now has a bigger part than me. But he has not he's, he's got a battle scene. <laughs> I'm Spartacus! He's got Agent Mulder from... Scully. Hi. Hello. <laughs> The funniest thing he's done for years. <laughs> so that's Alan Partridge. I don't speak like that. I don't talk that way. Yes, Stop I do. it. I'm quite perspiring with anticipation. Good Lord, what is this story all about? Cock and a bull story. It's Steve Coogan, Rob Brydon. In fact, if we went alphabetically, which I think is the only fair way, it would be Rob Brydon, Steve Coogan. Yeah, but that would just be ridiculous. <laughs>